Good morning, Booktube. It's um, Ben here from the History Fellow Channel. Um, I thought I'd do um, another book review today, um, but with a difference, because um, it's nothing to do with history or non-fiction. Um, we're going back to a book that I first read, I think, when I was about 13, 14. So um, I've reread it now, and it's utterly fantastic. Um, even better today than when I read it, sort of, back when I was four, 13, 14. Um, that was a while ago. Anyway, the book is The Hitchhiker's Guide to the Galaxy, um, written by Douglas Adams. Um, my particular copy was um, published by Pan Publishing, but... Um, there's many different um, publishing companies you can get it for. And it comes in paperback, but there's also, they've um, remade it into a film. There's also a BBC TV series about it. And there's all audio book, you can get it in Kindle, many different formats. But um, the book basically follows um, a character who's called Arthur Dent. Um, we discover him. He's woken up one morning a bit um, worse for wear. Um, obviously, he's been down the pub having a drink the night before, and suddenly he realises why he was drunk, and that's because um, he's got a line of bulldozers outside his cottage, is the home where he lives, and they're about to um, knock it down. And of course, he's only just discovered this news the day before. <laughs> so he's in a bit of a panic. The reason why they want to um, bulldoze his cottage down is they want to build a bypass. Anyway, he meets this um, fella called Ford Prefect, who actually turns out to be um, an alien. And... Um, He's discussing various ways with um, the main character, Arthur Dent, about what he can do to stop them and that sort of thing. And in the end, it turns out it doesn't really matter because the Earth's um, due for destruction anyway. So um, the story goes on and they end up in space on this spacecraft. They meet um, a character called um, Zaphod Beeblebrox. Um, and his new girlfriend calls she's called Trillion. And then there's various let's say escapades and problems they have to encounter and endure. And um that's probably all I'm gonna give f for now because it's a really good book and I don't really want to give away the ending or what happens. Cause um although quite a few people in the world have read this book. Um, I think if you haven't read this book, please go and give it a try. Um, it's part of a, the Hitchhiker's Guide of the Galaxy book is part of a set, um, a set of five books. So um, if you wanted to sort of take that as a challenge to read them, you could. Um, I'll just give you the titles, I've got them written down here. You've got the Hitchhiker's Guide to the Galaxy is the first one. Then you've got the restaurant at the end of the universe, followed by the um, life, the universe and everything. Uh, the fourth one is So Long and Thanks for All the Fish. And then the fifth one is called Mostly Harmless. And these are all written by Douglas Adams. Um, in my opinion, a really, really good author. Sadly, he's no longer with us now, but um, a fantastic man and a fantastic writer. And I'd say the books, if you imagine, if you've ever seen Monty Python, it's kind of a mix of Monty Python meets science fiction. Um, it's got lots of humor in, lots of comedy, and really things that will make you think. And there's one particular question, which you'll need to read the book, that gets answered that's quite important. And um, it's books along the lines of, um, it's like a precursor to the Terry Pratchett um, Discworld books. 
it's quite similar in that sort of vein but overall it's as I said it's a, a fantastic book I really enjoyed it when I was 14 I've really enjoyed it now rereading it it's got the same humor it seems to um, last through the years sort of thing and it's certainly well worth a read and I would definitely give this a five star rating so anyway that's my review of the book The Hitchhiker's Guide to the Galaxy written by Douglas Adams and available pretty much everywhere um, you can just buy the one um, paperback version or Kindle version but you can also buy it as part of a set but anyway, thank you very much for watching. I shall see you next time, probably in another book review. Um, if you've enjoyed this book review, you've or you've been inspired by it, or even if you've read the book and you want to tell me what you thought of it, whether you thought it was good or bad, I don't mind. Um, please write down below this video in the comments what you thought of it. And if you haven't already, please give us a like and a subscribe. It all really does help the channel to grow. Thank you very much anyway, and I shall see you in the next video.